What's up, YouTube? Dr. Jeremy here, and today we come right back into Persona 4 Golden. Now, bad news is, technically, uh, there was no place to save around here. So, the issue was, uh, yeah, so ignoring all that, we're back here. There was no place to save, so it took a bit of time to get back here. Anyways, so, let's get on to it, shall we? Hitting on some girls, apparently. Let's start with this, uh, jail fate, FBI, I suppose, over here. Here. There's a young girl standing there. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Que quieres? How will you spawn? Que haces? Vaya nada mal. Hablas espanol? No. Yo no hablo espanol bien, sorry. <laughs> Muy bien. Vamos a plaquear. ¿Cómo te llamas? Uh, me llamo Jorge. <laughs> Oh god, my uh, Spanish class, everyone! Spanish class! Ezio! Te llamas Jorge? Gusto encontrarte con Jorjito! She named you Jorjito, oh no! Entonces, ¿qué pasa, Jorjito? ¿Cuál es tu número de cre- I didn't actually read all that, oopsie daisy. No te lo puedo dar! My mom doesn't let me skip it down. My mom doesn't let me give it out to the strangers. But your Spanish is muy bien. Ready to be a citizen of the world. Well, I gotta go. Nos vamos. Nos vemos, Jorjito. <laughs> she thinks her name is Jorjito. Still. Oh no. Oh no. Spanish, everyone. Remember to take your multilingual classes when you're in high school. Oh boy. And that guy, that guy trying to pick me up was such a loser. That nose piercing of his man looked like a cow. <laughs> that sounds awful. What did he think he was? Eating about beef? A couple flashy high school girls are here. Want, want to talk to them? Yo, why not? What the hell? Who are you? Are you hitting on us? Well, he's kind of cute. We're not doing anything right now, so maybe you could hang out. I haven't seen you around. Where do you live? Huh. Do we want to say in the sticks? But this seems basic. But saying nothing. Uh, let's say... What? Really? But I've never seen you before. A base from Inaba he doesn't want to admit it. I heard Inaba so dead. The farm animals have taken over. Four legs good. Four legs good, four legs, two legs bad. <laughs> That's like the book. Let me hear you squeal, country boy. Yaddy yaddy. Oh, him, gee. What a prick. We were just kicking around. Yeah, who made you king of the universe? So lame. Let's go home. Ugh. I don't think I would want those numbers anyway. People who say OMG like that in public are nothing but ugh, normies. Gosh dang it, nothing again today. Older woman here, maybe you should talk to her. <gasps> okay, you seem young, how old are you? What do you do? I feel like she's not gonna be interested in a young high school. I, I don't know, she doesn't give the ara ara energy, so... Where? Do you work for a listed company? What's your annual take home? The woman is suddenly looking at you differently. Are you the oldest child? Second oldest? What is your family structure like? Do you live like with your parents? Is your parents house of rental or do they own? Or is it a house or an apartment? I feel like she's a... Now I feel like she's one of those gold diggers. Oh sorry, I just like to know these things. You mean you want you you want to know if you can gold dig? That's what you're asking, okay? I I'm not gonna read any more of this. I already know that you're just a gold digger, and I'm getting out of here. 
Oh god. Wait, what? <laughs> hey, who keeps saying that? Oh my goodness, why did I even say? I don't even know what's going on anymore. Don't say anything like Oh. Wow. Uh. You like kids, how many. What, what did I get into? <laughs> I actually have a half of a a marriage license all filled down, ready to go. I'm gay, whatever you are. Actually, you want to sign it now? Oh no. Let me get out. This seems like a good time to come clean. <laughs> Yeet. <laughs> One second year in high school, here's this kid. Don't make past that, you stupid little boy. If you're under 18, you're under my limit. Go talk to someone else. <laughs> Yeet. <laughs> oh my god. I almost got myself married. <laughs> Oh no, that's what you get without for a re Well, I guess technically I passed in, in a way. 20% off for coupon on meet Wednesdays at June ends. Is that what you're offering? God damn it, Yosuke, that's not how you work things. Phew, did not nearly just go? Oh boy, there's a lot of people to talk to. Can I help you with something? Uh, I'm not used to this. Everyone seems embarrassed. Ooh. Sorry, I'm really nervous. I can't really explain it. Uh, you're right. S sure, yes. It's time like these that one must be at uh, once calmest. I must regain the balance of my heart or evil aggression. Mm. Uh, the woman seems to breathe, started to breathe deeply. Phew, I'm alright now. My soul has been saved through God's intervention. Oh no. Are you aware of this? At this very moment, our world is filled with demons and despair. Wait, what are you going on about? That spear will invade people's coals. Eventually the world will become hard and cruel. Illness, accidents, bad luck, all even in this world seems from despair. Oh, I'm sure that is your soul and cries for hope are what brought you here to me. No one seems serious about this. However, you must not fear. There's still a path to salvation, young boy. If you pray to God, God, your soul will be purified and you will be able to live a happy, fulfilled life. No, okay, the world is uh, lame and uh, oh my goodness, you're a crazy one. The time is now. Find your happy place and you gain inner joy. What? What does the anime say? Um, pause for a second. I need to get uh, an anime scene for a second. I pray to the gods. I offer the gods my thanks. Was that it? <laughs> Anyways. Let's see here, what's going to happen? Then chat with me, let our hearts be as one, ready, here we go! Ha <laughs> ha, okay, no, I'm not saying that, I'm gonna say this. I pray to the gods! I offer the gods my thanks! <laughs> <laughs> oh god, no. You better chat with the woman. How it was long before you came to your senses, you failed to get yourself on number and now time's passed. Oh, boy. Did you hear Sato's son is grandmother now? Really, I did. Didn't her daughter just come of age? There are a couple of housewives here. Maybe you should talk to them. Oh no, this is the our outer energy here. <gasps> what is it? I'm hitting on you. Oh my god, you've got to be kidding me. You're hitting on an old lady like me. Well, I thought I shouldn't brag, but I was talking to town in my younger days. Me too. The men in town couldn't stop talking about me. They called me the Black Widow of Okina. That, what, what is that about? If you're making me remember things. <laughs> Housewives seem to be enjoying themselves in this conversation. You're a handsome one though. I'm sure you make, must be popular at school. You look serious, but I bet you play the field. Huh. That makes me sound like I have no standards. Uh, let's, let's sound humble. Wow, you're quite stoic for you. For a young man in your day and age. But you must be careful with me. If you fool around too much, you'll enrage some poor soul, and then you'll go to hell. <laughs> the housewives are having fun. Huh. Well, now the best waifu of the city. You. I'm at Okina Station. Nothing out of the ordinary here. Yes. Huh? What's the matter? Should I ask him or should I ask him that? Hey, what's your number? My number. If you're in an emergency, it's 1010. Wait, are you trying to hit on people? 
I have you kids so free, I wish I could join you. I mean, I could, I can't help you there. If you could find out that just by asking a police officer, I'm sure in my younger days, it would have been a lot more exciting. I want your number. What? My number? I don't know about that. <laughs> I have a wife and kids, I don't know if I want to explore. <laughs> Anyways, you're a kid, you should go home. The police officer is anxious. You shouldn't bother him about his number anymore. Ah, uh, yes, the best white boot. The police officer. Did I talk to you yet? Huh? Best cute boy like you want with me. Slam it! Oh, yes! Let's do the Brock! The Brock! Ah, it's love at first sight! Oh, you're funny. I like boys like you. I kinda like younger boys. You're instant adorable. It makes me want to educate them about some things. I feel like she she's actually waiting for someone. Huh. How do you feel about older women? Age means nothing. If it's true love... <laughs> ah, I see you're young and full of energy. I wouldn't mind spending time with you. Oh, do you really want to hang out? Not today, I mean, not if you don't want. Not if you don't want to, but if you want, I could teach you a lot about how grown-ups play. Things are going well. One more push, you may be able to get her number. I am scared. Because this is where something bad is going to happen. Huh. I think it will be easier to show you than explain. Oh, it's 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 her boyfriend's number. I know it. Nah. I know what's going on. It's, she's going to give me her, like, her boyfriend's number, right? You know what? It's actually going to be quite fun. Let's do it. Let's have this game. Let's play this game. Let's see. Let's get the boyfriends. Oh, okay. I, I guess that's how you end the day. How'd it go? Not as well as I hoped. I thought so. Oh, but I did get a phone number from some chick who said to give her a call. Does that count? Wait, you got one? A girl hit on you? What did she say? Was this the same one? Is, did she say that she was gonna have play a little game? Because I have a feeling we both got the same number. And I bet it's her boyfriend. Something like it only costing so much for an hour. I don't know. What was she talking about? Okay, never mind. You got a what to call it? How dense are you? There's no way that counts. Yeah, that sounds like um. Night, night. One of those night things. <laughs> what about you? Did you get anything? I got a little game. You guys want to have some fun? Well, the look on your face says you obviously scored. Is that a cell number? Why what kind don't of girl was it? Come on, you should call her up. The Dep depends if you if please. numbers are her. Pretty please. Here. Please. Yosuke, you can pick up the phone. What times are you gonna beg? <laughs> so you're gonna call her, right? Right? You decide to call him the number you got. I can't wait to see what's gonna happen. Who is this? Okay, hello, this is Domino's. Uh, hello? This is Domino's, we have your order of pizza. It's outside the door. Really, we don't have any options that aren't like... Stupid? Wow, that is lame. Oh, Maybe. You rat bastard! You're dead, shitbird! How dare you hit on my girl! I'll rip off your head and spit down your neck! Fuck your queen! If you do not like our services, please call. You better not call again, got it? Well, there goes the pizza. I can hear him from here. <laughs> Is that dude for real? Well, <laughs> that's the risk you take. All right. I'm up next. Freaking called it. You pulled it off, Yosuke Senpai? <laughs> of course I did. One phone number right here. Oh boy, I wonder what you got. Amazing. Man, it wasn't easy too. She was crazy hot. I just had to push myself a bit and go for a sexy older woman. So that's what you're into, Yosuke. Time to give her a call. Hello? It's me. Yosuke-kun? Yep, the guy who asked you out on a motorcycle ride. Man, I can't wait. Huh? You know my name? 
Did I tell you? Of course I know your name. <laughs> we go to the same school. Oh no. We do? Well, that's impossible. I mean you wait. That voice. This is Hanako Otani. Who did you think I was? Uh how did you get my number? How did the older random one oh wait. I think I know it now. Oh god! I'm in such deep shit! D did I call the wrong number? One more try. Hello, it's me. Yeah, I know who you are. You really want to go on a date with me that much? Everyone, run. Run, run right now. Block that? that number and get the heck out of here. It sounded like a fiend from the pits of the earth. Ugh, I could feel a chill go down my spine. Forget about it, for your own sake. This number is dangerous. It's better that you don't know what that was. Oh, you guys. Wait, she's here? Already? When? Hanako-san, why are you here? Hello. The countryside's no place for a girl like me. I was taking a walk when I suddenly got a phone call. <laughs> You're really into me, aren't you? A motorcycle date, huh? Well, if you want to take a ride that bad, I'll go with you. <laughs> Wait! Oh! Oh! That does not sound good. My motorcycle! You mean scooter! Oh, what's with this scooter? It's broken. See? Even she knows it's a scooter. If you want to take me out, you've got to do better than that. The best girls don't go steady for nothing, you know. You need to make an effort. Ugh. Oh my goodness. How is it smoking? Oh, cursed. It's not even on. It wasn't even on. Did I insult a gypsy or something? It's like my Uncle Kagi once said, with great power comes great big booty bitches. It's a curse. <laughs> Easy for you to say. I don't even have a way to get home now. Yep, that's what I mean. It's a curse. Senpai, you fought well. I was totally moved by all that. Come on, hop on behind me. I'll get you back home safe. Wow, and there goes a... Riff. Whoa, up close and personal. Oh. I get it now. So this is what your plan was about. <laughs> oh. oh, you don't get anything. And you're freaking me out. And dude, it's against the law to have two people on a bike. It's okay. Just put an end to this suffering already. Wah. You saw Yosuke off to the station and decided to go home with Kanji. You should be able to come to Okina on your own now. If you have enough experience with your scooter. Oh. Oh, Fendi. Welcome home. Here's a delivery. Here's the thing. Alright. I can work at the hospital. Yeah. <laughs> I'm already ranked four. Fine. I see if I can find Do not Dojima. What's his name? Adachi. I wonder if Adachi's out today. That'd be great. There, Adachi. Perfect. Oh. Oh, it seems you are bored. Are you studying? Students need to study. Want me to tutor you? Huh. Wow, how odd. Give me a break. Did that completely fly over your head? I forgot everything I learned in high school. Uh. uh but did you invite me over for dinner that... But you did invite me over for dinner that one time. But fine, just today, alright?
There we go. Uh, you guys studying? Wait, no. I don't even want to look at yours. Too complicated. Okay. So maybe I could help Dino Chance. Huh? Really? You would? I have some homework. A book review. Oh, those. They're really easy if you know what to do. You don't have to read the whole thing. Just read the notes on the back and then you summarize those. Adachi, seriously. She's like, what, a fourth grader? You, you, you're telling me to rip, read the bibli... That part of the book? Heck, there's better than that. If if you really are having that much trouble with the child's book, go on friggin' spark notes or something. I don't. My teacher said read it and I write what you think. And write what you think. Don't worry about that. We have to be efficient here. Oh boy. <laughs> Is that how you do your job too? <laughs> It sounds like he cut corners a lot. Uh. <laughs> Are you the same way? <laughs> what a bad older brother. Big bro, are you a punk? Come on, Nanako, bring your book. It wasn't a review. Mm. I just had to read it and then get a mark from grown up saying I did. Oh, okay, that's easy enough. Though, a mark. Dojima-san's going to be late today. Will you give me one Adachi-san? Me? Okay, if you're good, I'll draw you a big flower. I want one! <laughs> Alright, let's get this started then. Once in a deep, deep forest, near a tall, small river, there lived a pink alligator. Nanako is reading intently. And so no one remembered the pink alligator. Uh, even today, the lake is shining in the way it always did. The end. Huh. Oh, you're done. Do I get a big flower? Yeah, sure, I'll give you one. Yay! A flower! What about you? Don't you have anything you want me to draw a flower on? Adachi. Are you, are you kidding me? Ah, oh, you're no fun. Are you really related to Nanako Shan? Never mind. You look mature, but you're still in high school, you know. I'm not saying it should be you should be like me, but if anything happens, you shouldn't hesitate to bring it up to a grown-up. You tell Adachi where you about you feel like you know Adachi a bit more. Take a little nap. The old lady brought me some photos of potential matches. She kept insisting I see these girls because they're nice. I had to do overtime because of it. Like I ever get married. You don't want to get married? Marriage is where the fun goes to die. You'll understand about it in 20 years, Nako Chan. Come to think of it, don't you want something will be father in law, whoever Nako Chan decides to marry? Eesh. That's certainly going to put a damper in her chances. <laughs> oh boy. And what is that supposed to be? Really? There's just no way. Sorry, Nanako chan. No! I don't want to get married. I don't want to get married either. It's, I don't like people with holes in their socks. Wait, what? I don't have holes in my socks? You did the other day! Oh god, <laughs> the three of you spend a joke just because someone has holes in their socks? I don't think anyone even wears socks with holes in- Well, in all technicality, all socks have holes. But like, I think she means the giant holes. Who wears giant hole socks? You just throw those out and buy a new pair. They're not expensive at all, it's just socks. School, school camp starts tomorrow. We'll be in the same group, but... What should we cook it for dinner? Hey, we don't get everyone and go buy ingredients after school. Why don't we? Oh, yeah, we should probably do that. You do everything. You do it. 
Okay. I'm sure to get Chia and Yosuke Kun. Now then. Juness Grocery Department. Seems like everyone's gone out to buy some groceries. What do you put in curry again? Uh, let's see. We got curry leaves. We got uh spices such as um, what is it? Uh, I have the spices at home, but I forgot the turmeric's one. That's that's really orange. I have uh cloves. Uh, you know what? Never mind. Let's see what they Carrots. say. Potatoes, oh, you onions, made the actual ingredients. Mushrooms, green peppers, and radishes? Are radishes the same as turnips? Oh no. Oh no. Curry's fine, right? It's practically our national food. As long as, Yo as, long as Yukiko doesn't put any lobster in it. We were going back and forth between ramen and curry, but I thought ramen might not be enough for you guys. I wonder what kind of ingredients Yosuke likes. I get the feeling he's real picky. If you if it's edible, it's fine. You don't have to make it anything fancy or crazy to suit anyone's standards. He's on another floor, isn't he? Do you want me to go ask? Nah, no need. Plus, he said he needed to get ready for something. Hmm. Hey, Chie, you use potato starch for curry, right? You can use potato starch, flour, starch, anything that works as an adhesive that, emul that emuls and emulsions, you know, just to make things thicker because the, the, they they will unravel in strands and they'll collect with the water molecules, yada yada yada, stuff like that. Flour works fine, uh, starch works fine. Of course you do. Otherwise the sauce wouldn't thicken. Then we need potato starch and some flour too. Either or, you can just choose one. It doesn't really matter There's that much. Kinds this of is... flour. Which one should we get? All purpose? Whole wheat? Hmm. Whole wheat sounds healthy. That is unnecessary. Let's get that. We're not one. baking okay. bread here. Here they are. We are not trying to make a special kind of thing. We're just trying to make a ba could, could we just make a Sorry, basic peppers. It's not curry if it isn't spicy. N that's a lie. Oh well, let's just get everything that seems right. How about some kimchi too? Ooh, Wait, what? Some ground pepper. No. There's two kinds though, black and white. Whoa, way to go, Yukiko. The Amagi family sure knows their stuff. Let's get both, just in case. Everyone knows that there's black and white ground pepper. There's also whole peppers in... Uh, crack pepper. Oh my goodness, what are you guys doing? Oh yeah, we'll need some special ingredients too to spice things up. Define special. We don't need special. The curry can be curry and it'll just taste good. Don't make things crazy. I remember seeing something on TV about that. I think it was, um, chocolate, uh, coffee, yogurt? Okay, listen, you guys aren't LeBlanc. You can't, you guys don't know how to make the special, the, the special curry. What? Ooh, I no! Love that That's stuff. no. What are you doing? I don't like coffee that much, though. Oh, I can drink mocha, so let's get that. This. What is about it? some seafood? That should make the sauce taste better. No. Keep the lobster away. This is not gonna be a good day. Welcome back. Oh boy. This is a bad idea. This is a really bad idea. Well, it's time for camp. I don't Oh boy. Ugh, picking up all that trash was murder on my back. I can't believe someone threw away an entire bike. Wait, what? Damn it, litterers should have to deal with their own garbage. Anyways, time for dinner. 
Man, I'm starving. Uh, Dude, the girls cook just for us. Why are you so happy about that? You, you're the one who even talked about the fact that she can't cook. And I've tried Yukiko's cooking already. Not that I expect much out of Chie, but Yukiko's got the full tradition of the Amagi in behind her food. Oh no, you think that's actually a thing. You know it's gonna be out of this world. Oh, it's gonna be out of this world, all right. But not the way you think of it. Uh... This is to keep oh, you safe, no man. Way. I'm not falling for that. You just want it all for yourself, huh? I can't wait to dig in. Okay, the good thing is Yukiko's stuff at least tastes like nothing sometimes. But the fact that she has nothing and Chie, this isn't gonna end up good. Should we taste this? Huh? Only if you do it first. Oh boy. Oh man, here it comes! Why are there only two plates? Uh, sorry for the wait. Um... So, where's your guys' portion? Why don't we all eat together, huh? We put a lot of love into it! Well, really? That's kinda cliched, but still awesome! So does my parents, but I don't say my parents cook good food. Okay then, chow time! Goodbye, Yosuke. You have lived a long, healthy, happy life. Rest in peace. Hey! What the hell is this? I mean, what kind of... Curry's supposed to be, like, really spicy or kind of mild. This just stinks. And it's gritty, too. Gritty? It's somehow both... Gritty and slimy, and it's got squishy parts in it. Gritty and slimy. What did you guys use as a thickener? It's so freaking nasty, I can't even swallow it! Well, it just didn't mix too well. But it does offer a wide variety of textures. That's it's nauseating! Mm. Come on, it's not that bad. Have you guys tasted That's it? That's just your opinion. Well, then you eat it. I'm telling you as a friend, don't do it. I wouldn't even joke about trying that slop. Oh, no. Oh, no. And dead. There's no way you can eat it. It's inedible. Can't even swallow it. And I will die. There we go. <laughs> oh, we're sorry. Sorry. Okay, seriously, we all talk about how I can cook well. Why didn't I do the cooking? <laughs> what are we gonna do? Our group's the only one without food. Seriously, I mean, why? If it was even slightly edible, that'd be one thing. But I'm not taking another bite of this mystery food X. Why didn't we let me do the cooking? My goodness. Something smells good. Hanako. I don't have any choice. And besides, she owes me, considering what she did to my motorcycle. That ain't gonna happen. Hey, uh, Hanako. You wouldn't happen to have any extra curry left, huh? Come on, give us some! We're begging you! We're starving to death here! No way! <laughs> I'm on a diet right now, so this is all that I made. It has to last me. All that you made? It's like a bucket full. Oh, I wonder if there's any way we can get something delivered <sighs> here. Oh, yeah, that could work out. But our cell phones don't get service up here. Okay, now that just makes the anime entirely off then. <laughs> and dinner time's almost over. All right, back to your tents. Men's tents are this way, and the girls' tents are that way. Come on, people, look alive! Youngsters like yourselves should hurry up and get to bed after they eat. It's now time for us teachers to have some boo. I mean, uh, after bed! Lights out!
You guys gotta say booze. You guys are gonna pay for this. <laughs> Night. <laughs> sure, brought snacks. Inside views in those Yosuke's tent. Damn it. I'm so hungry. Why is that side lifted up? And how the hell did you end up here? My teach threatened to hold me back a year if I didn't show. And the first year's tent is all quiet. Like someone died. Well, if you were in there with him, I'm not surprised. Is it just you two in this tent? The other guys called in sick. Smart move. So it's okay if I hang out here? Yeah, why not? I don't really seem to care. Hey, you're a stand-up guy, senpai. Don't worry, I won't make any trouble for you. They won't catch me unless we raise a ruckus. All right, all right, you can sleep over there. Dude, there's a huge rock under there. How am I supposed to sleep? Who set these tents? Head. Pipe down! Didn't you say you weren't gonna make any noise? Yo, senpai, can't you go just a little further back? Nope. There's a slope just past here. I'd roll down the hill in my sleep. Why is this tent even here? If you don't like it here, go back to the first year tent. Hey, wasn't your teacher some guy called King Moron? Yep. That guy stopped me outside earlier and he pissed me off so bad I was about to lose it. He was going on and on about when I was in middle school. When he doesn't know shit about any of that. Not only that, he was bullshitting about how I'll be expelled immediately if I cause trouble. That ain't funny, man. Yeah, that guy set a speed record for jumping to conclusions. Check this out, right? I heard it from a guy in my class. He said that asshole was talking shit about the two girls who died. That, King Moron was talking about Ms. Yamano and Saki-senpai? That does not surprise me, to be honest. It was like, it's no surprise that people who are unfaithful or run away from home meet a bad end. I don't know, maybe he was exaggerating. Everyone seems to hate that son of a bitch Moraoka. It's also no surprise that he would talk like that. Damn, I could just picture him saying that. He never shut up about me either when I moved here last year. Not that I remember anything he said. Who would? Who cares? Even if it's only a little true, it still pisses me off. The dickhead's a damn teacher, for God's sake. Yosuke, why are you eating? Nah, don't waste your energy getting pissed at that clown. Yeah, you got a point. Wait a sec. What are you eating? Animal crackers? What the... Those are mine! Damn it! I was so pumped about finding the penguin today. Penguin? The secret animal cracker! You were eating them and you didn't know that? Are you serious? Well, you should have said something. Oh well. Oh, this isn't gonna fill me up. Let's just go to sleep. That's all you gotta say for yourself after taking my snacks. <laughs> Kanji, don't you have more space on your side? And I can't sleep over there. Or my back's gonna break. Oh, okay. Uh, hey. Yeah? Why'd you come to this tent? <laughs> I already told you. Jeez, wrong with you. This is as good a time as any, so I want you to be honest with us. Uh, okay. Are you really, you know? Am I really what? What I mean is, um, are we going to be safe alone with you? Yes, yeah, just because he's gay doesn't mean he has standards. I mean, I'm not judging or anything. It's cool. But since we're sharing a tent and all, I just... No. There are some things that I don't wish to try. What? What? What the hell is that supposed to mean? I already told you guys I'm not like that. Okay, maybe he's not gay, but uh, he has still he has standards. 
<laughs> well, then why are you all hot and bothered about it? That's just more suspicious. Hell no! You guys made me get up from bed. We settled this already, damn it. Right now I'm... Well, how do I put it? Uh... Oh, God, don't trail off like that. You're freaking me out. I'm trying to tell you that I have no problem being around girls now. Can you prove it? <laughs> prove it? Because if you can't, we're going to be stuck here all night, half scared to death. <laughs> to hell with this. If that's what you really think of me, then I'm going to go hit the girls' tent right now. Yeah, it's gay. This ain't no disease. <laughs> this ain't going to affect, infect you. Wait, well, that's a little extreme. You don't have to go that far. Well, you are being a little bit extreme, yes, okay? They'll expel you if they find you. Don't tell me you forgot. King Moron's got his eye on you. Yeah, like that stuff a man like me. You say King Moron's got an eye on him, but I bet King Moron's also drunk right now. Dude, seriously going for it. Hey, man, you gotta stop him. Go get him, beggar. <laughs> Hell yeah. Now you'll see. To hell with King Moron! No one's stopping Kanji Tatsumi, damn it! Uh, hey, wait! This is one tall tent. What a putz. I declare myself not responsible for anything that happens. You initiate it. Meanwhile, in Chi and Yosuke and Yukiko's tent. Oh boy. <sighs> Now I get why we're the only three in here. It's called res respiratory issues. Stop. I can't sleep. Oh, I'm hungry too. I should have eaten a little more of that curry. If you could. It might have knocked us unconscious. You know, actually that might be a good, a good idea. <laughs> Sheesh. We can't sleep. We can't walk around. I wonder what Teddy's doing right now. Being alone all day is pretty rough when you think about it. You know, a while ago he... Oh my goodness, who snores like that? Even if someone snores, I never heard a snore like that. That does it! Yukiko, we're out of here! Where'd we go, though? I don't think climbing down the mountain is a good idea. Do you think she'd stop snoring if I covered her nose and mouth? Yo, oh, boy. No, 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 Yukiko, no! Oh, I can't take it anymore. <gasps> Who, who's there? Hey, are you guys still up? What the? What the heck are you guys doing here? What are you doing here? This is the guy's side! Well, I can only guess Kanji did something. <laughs> Let us in! Don't be ridiculous. If King Moron finds out, we'll all be expelled. Go back to your tent! We can't! Are there any rotten apples out and about? Any indecent students out there? Just the drunk person. All right, hurry up and get in. So why are you two here? Well, it's Kanji-kun. Wow, he actually He's went up and did it. out cold. Wait, how is he out cold? I, I don't know what happened. He just came in and then, and then he, he fainted all of a sudden. That's all, right, Yukiko? That sounds very sus. Huh? Uh, yeah. So there was no way we could sleep with him lying there, and you know, if we woke him up, he might have made a fuss. You sure you didn't smack him in the head? That's why we left him there. What? That makes no sense. He busted into your tent, then suddenly fainted. Listen up! Being insolent and being indecent are very different things. Also, saying two words that sound the same, thinking that they are exactly the exact same word, 
only makes you more of an idiot. It's him. He's right outside. Just because the word sounds the same, obviously it's not going to mean the same thing, you freaking moron. Hey, turn the light off. You said King Moron, getting closer. Hey, are you two in there? Answer me! Why would I say that? Why would I say anything? This sounds stupid. This looks stupid. We're not here. Huh? Ah, so you're in there. Is Hanamura already asleep? Yes, sir. Fast asleep, sir. You should have snored. Don't get cute, Hanamura. Shut up and go back to sleep. <laughs> Man, this is one drunk idiot. Ugh. I think I have one too many. I'm so sleepy. Huh. <sighs> there goes a couple years off my lifespan. No joke. We were nearly expelled! And whose fault would that be? This is you guys' fault! Wh what else are we supposed to do? Anyways, we can't leave now! We'll sneak out before the others wake up tomorrow! Is that good enough for you? What are you so pissed off for? You better not try any funny stuff while we're asleep. Is that clear? Hey, we didn't say you could... Damn it, you owe us for this. Hmm. <laughs> Set up a barricade inside the tent using everyone's belongings. Just oh right, and now there's four people in a tent that has a freaking rock on the side. <laughs> wow, I can't imagine to see how freaking. Oh wait, I guess we're not gonna see. But man, I bet that. Ugh. Could only be bad. Looks like we're the only ones here. What's wrong? Got a stomach ache? No, it's just... I thought I got pissed and ran out of the tent last night. It's so weird. Was it a dream? When I woke up. I was in Yosuke's senpai's tent. What? It, it, it was a dream. Must have been a dream. Okay. All right, then, let's get swimming. I think I like the anime versions better. Are you seriously taking a swim? Then I'll pass. I'm still all stiff. What are you looking at us for? If you guys want to swim, go right ahead. You know, you two still owe us. Huh? Whoa, 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 whoa. We're not going in there. Ah, no, we don't have any spraying equipment. If I jump in here with this, we're all gonna catch a cold later. I mean, we do owe you, but... Oh, yeah! We don't have swimsuits with us! Man, of all the luck. Yeah, it really is unfortunate. <laughs> oh, I see how it is. We put up with your dinner, we save you from King Moron, and you won't even have some fun with us in the river. Man, Yosuke, you gotta learn how to phrase things better. No, it's really too bad. It'd be no problem if I just had a swimsuit. <laughs> Ta-da! I've got you covered. No problem. From Juness's summer line. I'm sure they'll fit you perfectly. Uh, is that what you left to go get at Juness? Oh, dude, that is messed up. And you're carrying these, Yosuke. They're Juness brand originals from our brand new line of swimwear that just came in for the summer. I had a clerk friend of mine choose them for me. Pretty swanky, huh? And the size fits. Why would you know that, Yosuke? Dude, that's just wrong. Did you have those this whole time? Come on, let's all go swimming. And where is it? What should we do, Yukiko? So, Yosuke, where's our swimwear? It'd be no problem if I just had a swimsuit. You know, we really were looking forward to dinner. 
I wonder what would have happened if we didn't help you guys last night. We get it already. Sheesh, you just never let things go. All right, that's more like it. How far off Where did our swimsuits come from? <laughs> come on, let's get in. Whoa, man. Stop staring like that. Hey. Yosuke, yours looks kinda of baggy. Well, I think I already started a streak with you, so why not? Stop it. Besides, I don't think saying both gives me anything or it gives me one note. I'm not too sure. Man, this is going even better than I expected. Kinda makes up for having to eat that mystery food X last night. Come on, you guys got to admit I chose some good suits. Those girls might be childish on the inside, but I bet they're going to turn into some fine-looking women before too long. And you're saying this here and now. Don't you think so? If I say this, I they would be pissed at me. And if I say this, they'll also be pissed at me. I might as well just compliment them. <laughs> you guys crossed the line. Yo, listen. I'm pretty sure either choice would you you got you would have been pissed at me. Cause I only have two choices here. Definitely. <laughs> it's freezing! You didn't have to push us in! Who cares? You were going in the river anyway. They brought this on themselves. Jeez. Aren't they the worst, Kanji Kun? Hey, you've been awful quiet. Are you feeling okay? Don't don't tell me the injuries from yesterday are still Injuries? Uh What? What? <laughs> that was close. What, what was that for? I didn't do anything. Hey, what's gotten into you? Huh? Do you hear something over there? Oh, no. It seems King Moron is vomiting up her, up the river. So that's why no one else was here. Good thing we noticed before we went in. Oh, uh, no. Senpai. Don't say it. Can we, like, move out of the way? At least out of the way of the stream? Uh. Oh, welcome home, big bro. How was school camp? Torture. Anyways, guys, with that over, I'm gonna pick some stuff and thank you for watching. Remember to like and subscribe. Ah, uh, that was disgusting. Anyways, see ya.